Hey guys, it's me again, Barry with Barry's 8-Track and Classic Car Radio Repair, and this is going to be a very short test on a unit that the customer has requested to be repaired to original stock. Uh, this comes from Jeremy in Vaughn, Washington. It's out of a 1970 Dodge Charger, and uh, it was sent in because uh, it, it uh, the 8-Track section would not change track. So we're here to make sure it's working again before we send her back, so let's go ahead and turn it on. I've got it set to the one strong AM station I get in my area. But, uh, why then have any masks on airplanes? You just you do a quick speaker check, make sure we got both sides. Balance left. Balance right. Left. Right. Okay. Don't need that anymore. Let's try the A-Track. Neil Sedaka. We can't do that without you. With your support, we've been able to... Switch tracks a bunch of times. Okay, the end of the tape, end of a song there. Okay, no cross talk between tracks. Okay, I think we're coming up on an automatic track change. Yep, coming up on an automatic track change, so we'll let it do that. There we go, automatic track change. Alrighty, pull the tape out and the radio comes right back. So that concludes the test. Everything is groovy and it's working properly. She's ready to go back and I'm ready to get on to the next job. I'm Barry with Barry's 8-Track and Classic Car Radio Pair and this was a very simple uh, quick test. Uh, it doesn't, doesn't, it's not a conversion so there's not a whole lot of stuff to test on it. Um, and uh, my website is in the description below. I do ask all customers to visit my website before calling me with a bunch of questions because my website is my catalog. There's a lot of very important safety precautions that I'm not going to remember during a phone call so you have to go through my website first. Uh, thanks so much for watching listening and thank you again Jeremy for your business from Washington and we'll see you guys next time